Hello, welcome to ECDEL, where we train future civil and structural engineers. My name is Fashe Ochet. Today, what do we have to discuss uh, in today's uh, lesson? Though this uh, structure, as you are looking at it, might look small, but there are a lot of things small by a little bit require thinking. Is that okay? That even a little bit cause uh, want to cause an uh, argument between me and the architect. But at last, he was able to understand my own point of view and the adjustments were, were made. Now, looking at this particular structure, if you look at it, why are we having this? Can you see this place now? Can you see it? Different levels. Are we together? Different levels. And if you look at this particular structure, can you see how it is? Is that okay? Can you see how it is? You can see this place also. Can you see how it is? Can you see here? And if you look at this place also, because we are also thinking of reducing the cost for the client. Is that okay? If you look at it, because this is a roof aspect, this is a roof beam. Is that okay? This is the roof aspect. This place, they are the roof aspect. So some beams were deleted. Now, if you look at this place, this column is very, very okay. If I delete this beam now, if I delete this beam, understand, the height of this particular wall, understand, will be reduced. So if you now look at this place now, since I've deleted the beam, of this particular place now understand because it's the total height of my block plus my roof beam that makes the total height isn't it so since i'm i've removed the beam i've removed the beam from here it then means that it's going to be my block wall that's going to fill up this place up to this height so you can see the thinking now the thinking that i'm talking about thinking is that okay so that is that and this column is very also important in this place so that's why it's being left like that. Is that okay? And some other places like that, that columns were what sorry, the beams were deleted because your based on this span now, your um wood is that okay. Your wood can actually pass through this span, can pass through what uh span this uh, this particular place. Is that okay? Can go through this particular place. So in other word to reduce the cost for the client. It's not everywhere you are going to put the major part is what is surrounding. Is that okay? It's the surrounding beams, roof beam, and there's some part inside. Is that okay? Which you can also see this one like this. Is that okay? So that is there. That is that. You can see our staircase and the rest. Now, looking at this, I want to take you through the card. Is that okay? Through the card. We are architect and I wanted to have a, an argument. Not really an argument, but at least we are able to come to understanding. So looking at this, if you look at this drawing, this is what this is a ground floor plan. And also this is what this is the first floor plan. But before we proceed, I want to say this is Ekidel, where we train future civil and structural engineers. In case this is your first time of watching our video, I want to say there are a lot of video we have done that if you watch it, I can bet you you can collect a project on just a story building and you're able to design it successfully. That's if you're able to watch through our video. So if you can also you can, you can be good just only watching our video you can now imagine when you now enroll for our mentorship so on this ground i want to say we have what called academic mentorship class whereby we train you specially just beyond what we are watching on this uh, particular video is that okay or this channel so now it's not very it's not expensive at all it's not expensive is that okay so that is a that and if this is your first time i want to to do us a favor and also do yourself a favor by also doing what by clicking on the subscribe button and also give this video a thumbs up is that okay because the more they like the more this video actually go viral go places that others who are also looking for means of learning this kind of thing you will be able to have, have what access to it and also subscribe in order to learn more is that okay so that is a that is that so subscribing is free you don't need to pay anything so just click on subscribe and it doesn't take you anything just to subscribe is that okay and also to like just a click is that okay all right thank you so much for doing that for subscribing being your first time and also for liking this particular video so let's start if you look at this video now you could see the ground floor plan and also the what the first floor plan as you can see we have what patio slash roof what garden all right so now you can see the shape of our staircase and all of that. So that's the first floor. Sorry, yes, first floor. For the ground floor, let's go through it. So you can see this place now, which means that this place is what there's a cantilever here. Is that okay? 
there's a cantilever here on this place and also on this other side there's a cantilever you can also see this door here is that okay all right so if we also look at it can you see that same door can you see it now this is how you study your plan can you see it here and also if you look at this place now if you look at this place can you see what we are having the same shape here is that okay this one like this this one goes like this which is this one like this here this one like this here is that okay like this that on the ground floor isn't it like this then this shape here that comes like this this way can you see it here so you're all joined together to this place all of this we are going to do the video from beginning to the end to the foundation is that okay so that's that so if you now look at this place now it's not just modeling it's required thinking like i said so if you now look at this place now this place is what is rock you can see rocky area rocky area rocky area and also a rocky area is that okay now looking at this if you now look at this place now is what there are buildings there are things there are rooms isn't it bedrooms where wash uh, wash hand whatever whatever and then this one wc and then also this bedroom around this side and around this side but if you now look at this place now this place particular place we only have one here and that one look at it here then from this place like this we have something like this come like this is that okay this way and come like this and like this can't you can you see like this come like this this way down like this and like this so now this rocky place it then means that at the roof of this the roof of this is on the same level to this rock i don't know if you can imagine that kind of a terrain where the this particular room have would be raised from foundation up to the first floor level that's about three meters high it now be the same level that three meter high of this is now the same level with this uh, what they call it with this rocky rocky area now don't mind you that whatever as you are slapping this place here is the same level with this place can you see which means that this place now is the same thing as this one though this other aspect is not starting from the ground isn't it but this other aspect is starting from the rock which is from here like this like this like this it started from the rock that this particular one is on the rock all these places now they are on the rock and like this on the rock why this place the whole of this place now is on the soil down down is that okay about three meters down all right so having taken you through all of this let's now go into our proto structure why we are having that and i'm in the next video we are going to be doing the ga everything together is that okay now clicking on this one now let's wait for you to come up all right click on, on this one now can you now see that we are having we are having the same level of slab the reason is because the reason why i'm doing this some might be thinking that <clears throat> why should we need put a slab here why do you need to put a beam here don't forget that on that place on that rocky side which is at this place you cannot dig you cannot dig isn't it since you cannot dig there will be need for you that's reason, reason number one there's a need for you to look for means of holding the column and the best way to hold the column is to do what apart from little part we are going to do there's need for you to do what to run your beam is that okay to run your beam to help you hold it and this is the beam is that okay i'm still going to explain why the slabs is that okay so there's need for you to do what to run your beam to hold all these uh, columns is that okay to hold these columns to hold this column and also to hold this column here and also this column here okay this one is for the second side yes this one is okay and to hold this column here and to hold this one here is that okay so all these beams are to help us to hold to hold the columns to hold all the columns now the question now is if we have already agreed that okay we are going to hold the columns because of the the terrain of that place going to be on the rock it's in a good foundation understand the stability at the, at the base is very important now the question now is why are we having a slab that is the question now, isn't it so now let me now go to the 3d of this is that okay let me click on the 3d and let's let's bring it up at the 3d is that okay okay why is it not coming up let me see something let me see let me see um am i having something on the ground yes okay let me close this all right so then the question now is why are we slabbing this place why are we slabbing it we are slabbing it because hope you know that there's no how it's very rare for you to have a 
a, a, a rock rock that just go up straight and then flat just like look at my cursor straight like this and like this it's very rare understand you are going to have something like this in form of a curve a bend at this place can you see my cursor it's going to be have something like this now if you are going to be having something like this are you getting it if you are going to be having something that like this then the question now is at this point how are they going to do it are they going to feel it is that okay if they are going to feel it what is the stability of it which then means if care is not taken there may be need for us to do what to do a, a, a wall here isn't it a retaining wall here to raise it up but they don't want to do that isn't it because of expenses is that okay so then if that is the case if that is the case then that's why we have to provide this particular slab can you see it now this particular slab because if you don't put slab we only put a what they call it um we only put a what they call it um only beam that means this place is now will not be void all these places will not be void like this all these places will not be void and void is that okay which means that on this place there's no they are going to fill it with sand and if they are filling it with sand what's going to happen around this place around here so that is why either they fill this place or not whatever they want to do there good and fine either they want to use minor uh, concrete to just fill the remaining this little space that is going to happen around this curve here is that okay so whatever they are going to do there that one is a minor job but the most important thing that is to secure this particular floor is that okay now because this particular floor here is the same level with this other side this other side so you can now see the thinking that we are talking about is that okay and the question now is how do you go about modeling of this particular place how do you go about modeling this particular place is that okay how you can see it and with a different level of foundation can you see different level of foundation is that okay though we have done one whereby there's a way you go about it i want to show you the other way of doing this particular aspect is that okay so all of this is what we are going to be doing in our next video as you can see that place of patio is that okay that place of patio you are seeing um that place can you see can you see this place now can you see it can you see this shape now this shape that come like this and like this so you can actually see it here now can you see it can you see it like this like this and like this so this one you are seeing here is just like your hand ray to serve as a hand ray is that okay which definitely they are going to provide isn't it they are going to provide in this place is that okay and also this place also there is going, definitely going to be what uh hand rail is that okay there's going to be a hand rail around this place around this particular place isn't it um sorry let me click somewhere else somewhere here. okay so can you see it now there's going to be hundred because there's a door here isn't it so that is a that is that so you can now see that this structure though it's small but it's quite thinking because the actor was like there's no even need of anything around this side understand that once you just model only this particular place like this and just submit i say no there's need for us to do a clean job understand and think ahead is that okay the possibility of that place i've not visited the site but from my own thinking i know that there's no way you can have a rock that is straight like this and also like this definitely it's going to be like this which in a later you now say oh it is true understand it should be on phone we have been talking and we have been talking and all of that so that is it so it's very important you as a structural engineer you should be able to picture whatever thing you are designing you should be able to picture it how how uh how true how effective it is is it realistic because some architects understand they can design but the reality of it is, is is very very hard is that okay so you are the one to do what to think and look at the and imagine how that structure is going to be in real life is that okay so for you to be a good structural engineer you must be able to picture things the reality of structures is that okay how is it going to look like at sight what's the possibility of this place is it realistic if it's not realistic what's the possibility all those things you have to be able to think very well and very fast is that okay beyond the drawing because even once you see something like this this particular drawing like this before they build it you must have seen it from your own imagination you have already seen the building how it's standing how all these places are standing understand so you must be able to do that if you cannot do that excuse me you are yet to be a good structural engineer is that okay so i bet you that's just the truth is that okay because what they are sending it to you apart from the 3d they are sending it to you at the time they will send the 3d yes good and fine but even the 3d you still have to picture it very well and look at it how possible is this aspect so 
structural engineer we have a lot to do is that okay so that's that so thank you very much till i see you next time in our next video whereby i will now start the ga we start the ga for all of this up to the level of this place understand where we have a different level of what of foundation is that okay and the method i'm going to be using to show you is that okay we have two methods all the two methods i'm going to show you is that okay and i'll explain them is that okay because this beam that is running here is meant to go straight and hold this rock side are you getting now so the beam that is running from here that is running from here from this top here from this top here they are meant to come and hold these columns around this place that is why you are seeing this place like this the column is running through is that okay and if the column is running through automatically if they are going to be slapped they will have the same level of slab do you get it now so that is a that is that so thank you very much let's see you in case you have not subscribed please click on subscribe button if this is your first time and if you have not also um, like this video please i want to say please again for the sake of your love for ekdel click on like button and also share this video to others all our videos you have been watching that have been helping your life why not why don't you share it to somebody though you might be thinking of data but don't forget that you are also helping people's uh, life understand so as we are trying to do the video and you are watching it and it's helping you you can also help another person by sharing the video or by even sending the link to the person to go and watch so if sending the video might cost you a lot of data you can just send the link which will not cost so much is that okay to the person your friend who is also in the same field is that okay so thank you very much till i see you and we have what we call equity mentorship class whereby we train you specially in fact i want to even use this minute to say congratulations for those that just graduated graduated yesterday is that okay and some are about graduating i think this week in tomorrow or next tomorrow some will also be graduating is that okay from the training is that okay academic mentorship class is very very wonderful in fact it's when you come in you say test and see that the lord is good the same thing test and see the mentorship class and you now discover that yes indeed all this why if you have known you will have registered is that okay so that is that and we also have a if you cannot enroll for a full mentorship class you can enroll for just four weeks depending on what you want to learn is that okay all right so that's the that is that and we also have a group whereby many engineers have come together to be helping one another anytime there is a challenge is that okay they can post it there and before you know it's the question whatever question you put there or whatever challenge that is you've been it's been thrown in that place you see engineers coming together to help you solve the problem so thank you very much till i see you next time when we'll be doing the ga up to the modeling analyzing and design of our foundation is that okay as you can see so let's even check the structure to see if that's passed the the design where's my review correct this is portal structure 2022 also, also we have a portal structure 2024 and we also have portal structure 2025 is that okay it's very they are all available in our bio so you can just go online and get our bio and do what and get your own software is that okay perfect one that will not give you any problem is that okay so let's check can you see every design can you see an interactive design have been done is that okay so that's there that you can see the structure perfect and okay and good to go is that okay thank you very much let's see you next time in our next video i want to say bye